Pat Garrity and his wife Judy are enjoying retirement. Both volunteer and work hard to stay healthy. Pat was interested in whether taking various supplements would help him do that, so he entered SELECT, the Selenium and Vitamin E Cancer Prevention Trial. I thought it was an opportunity because of this large study base to get some factual data to prove or disprove uh, the idea that uh, selenium or vitamin E might be beneficial. The original study with more than 35,000 men closed early in 2008. Researchers determined there was no benefit in taking these supplements and preventing prostate cancer. We did notice, however, at the time the original study was closed, that men who were taking vitamin E alone we're trending toward having a higher risk of prostate cancer. Dr. Eric Klein from the Cleveland Clinic and co-authors continued following select participants for an additional 18 months, even though the men were no longer taking the supplements. The men were healthy overall, 50 years and older, and from 427 study sites in the U.S., Puerto Rico, and Canada. Men who took vitamin E alone at 400 international units a day, in addition to a normal diet, were at a 17% higher risk of developing prostate cancer. The study appears in this week's JAMA, Journal of the American Medical Association. The long-term follow-up of SELECT suggests that in that particular population that taking vitamin E can actually be harmful. And so that's the important observation. Also important, researchers say, is how the public views supplementation. Many tend to think adding additional vitamins and minerals to their diet can help treat specific conditions. These agents can have an effect, a biologic effect, even after you've stopped taking them. There just doesn't seem to be any reason to be taking vitamin E if you're a man uh, over 55 or 60. Pat says he always discusses taking any additional supplements with his physician and will also continue having a yearly prostate exam. Yeah, I can put this over there too. I'll do that. He and Judy say eating healthy is how they get the majority of their vitamins. My wife and I have always thought the best thing to do is what our mothers taught us to do is stick with the basic food groups, do everything in moderation and everything's going to work out well. Catherine Dolph, The JAMA Report.